little clash. The idea behind my my when the earth and the banner earth is still round. Is that the um is here we have the this born to win. Basically, um, there's the uh, two boxes. Round. There's a red box and a blue box, and you hover over each box and animation. And one animation, red box Whatever animation. On the um, and here's some questions. So you play a game. Answer yeah. the questions to receive a chance to win the yeah, trip sure. to the. Uh, let's just change the color of that, but Olympics. What is oh, the no, inner no, color no. of the diamond pattern seen yeah, when hovering yeah, over the cyan box? Um, so let's say you type in blue, scenario, hopefully. Like, what is the first word of the name of a shoe company? So when you look at this animation, you see it's, com it's comfort kick, yeah, so you have comfort. Yeah, and since they're both correct, it will, yeah, you need to go and this, it shows the alert first. It will just, it says correct, text 55555 to redeem your prize. So let's try it again with the, uh, with uh, an incorrect one, correct one isn't, and it says, oh, it still says correct. Um, uh, I'll fix that. I'm just in the middle of it. Um, okay, so the second one when it's incorrect, no shaming game. Let's see if we can fix that. But um, let's go to uh, animate to see how I created the animation when you hover. So you just animate. Uh, just. I mean, I could have done, done HTML, and I'm not really sure if, like, I, I keep doing it this way, like, I, it'll mix in with, well, with my ego plots of how to how to do that in the first place, which I could just do an HTML code and create animations and then transfer it in that way. I wanted to learn it. So here we go. Uh, basically, the first step in creating animation, animation when you hover over the button is well I got so the red box the, button so when you go to uh, Tower of if you go to uh, insert new symbol and you go to button you insert a button symbol then you can go I got one over here is red box button so you see up down and over you always want to put so I'll put the image here you always want to put an up because when it's up that's what image gonna show if you don't have an image there it's not gonna work then over uh, basically over, like I put a movie clip in there. So in order to do that, you have to go, if you go back to scene one and you go to modern insert, new symbol, movie clip, and you type in the name of the movie clip. And over here on the right, I just have the movie clip. The same, uh, let's see here. The same place that we find in Chola Vista. Okay, so this is the movie click. If I double click on it, you have, you can basically, only, uh, I'm still in role so let's play the movie clip. I made it again. with all the, uh, with the, uh, bone tool used from the uh, ebook. Uh, I'm still not very perfect at it. I gotta look at some Chicano stuff. But, um, that's the bone tool. And yeah. so when I got the movie clip, I never if I go back to the, if I go to the button and go to over, then I drag in the movie clip when so it's selected on over, and then it turns out like that. So when I when I hover over it, it shows the uh, the uh, the movie clip. The rest is not really new. If we all I think we all took JavaScript, so it's uh it's just HTML. Yeah, uh, to um, my dilemma is I, I'm still working on uh, the actions. Um, I so finally just figured out that like super track and super when you put when it, when you use the action, the code at a certain yeah. frame, it adds the code in already, so you don't have to go and add it in. That's what I thought at first, but I still I still need to create like a smaller analog uh, a parallel uh, test to see if it's working out. Because so I want to be able to create links from Chicago, the animation. I think it's Chicago, really neat. Chicago. Instead of just creating the animation and going to Photoshop Chicago. and create the animation there, you can do it on one place because it really organizes your, your, your stuff better and like we get results. You get results of like better like professionalism and stuff. Okay, thank you.